<laughs> no, yeah, my um, my manager sent me the script for Wish Upon, and I thought it was really cool because I really love like horror movies and the the thriller type genre. So I read it and I, I looked up you know John Leonetti and what he had done and saw that he had worked on The Conjuring and Annabelle, and so I was definitely really excited. Yeah, yeah, they're kind of like the trio, um, me, June, and Meredith, and Joey's character Claire. Yeah, so we're all kind of, you know, like this trio of best friends, really tight. Um, and then when all of this creepy stuff starts happening with the box and with all the magic, you know, we, we kind of see how their friendships change. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of cool. But June is a really cool character. She's very laid back. Um, bit of a tomboy, you know, kind of just wants to live her life very relaxed. There's just something kind of unique about it. Um, because I think that it's very easy, especially when it comes to, to teenagers, to become very stereotypical. And I think that there are, there are certainly like certain groups in high school that can get very clicky, you know? You can pretty easily identify like who the rich kids are or who like the theater kids are, the nerds, you know? Um, but I like that this, this movie kind of delves into like that, you know, like the more average kind of stuck in the middle type person, which I feel like a lot of us can relate to, the, the type of people who didn't really fit into a particular clique. Um, so we kind of just made our own. So I like that. I, it does feel a little John Hughesy to me because, I mean, they're all very distinctive characters. M Meredith is super confident and, and sporty and like, um, you know, just says what she wants. And June is kind of more of a voice of reason. And yeah, it's, it's cool. Oh my gosh. Uh, I think, like, I don't know if you've seen, like, the Final Destination movies. Um, they're not, like, Oscar-worthy, per se, but what makes them so terrifying is that all of everything that happens is something that could, like, feasibly happen. You know, like, freak accidents. Um, so that's kind of how I feel about this one, too, is that it's, it's all stuff that is, like, potentially possible, which is why it scares me to death. Like, there is an elevator scene at one point. No. It's terrifying. Like, mm -mm. small box? Nope. No.